Twice a year, the sun does this one thing that attracts photographers to California Street in San Francisco. Oh, this is quite a party. <laughs> Shortly after sunrise, our nearest star will line up straight down California Street. Good morning, good morning. <laughs> Some call it California Henge. I, this is my first. Oh, okay. We'll see. <laughs> This crowd is growing at the crest of a hill at California and Gough Streets. The goal is to photograph the sun when it's just above the middle tower of the western span of the Bay Bridge. I was out yesterday to take a picture of the clouds. <laughs> Cloud cover is threatening to cancel the show. Some arrived hours ago to claim and defend their territory. A few feet to the right or left could ruin the composition. This side look good. Yeah. Little bit. It seems simple. Wait for the big orange ball to be just above the tower and... To make this even easier, nowadays we have apps that track the movement of the Earth, planets, and stars. If you do your homework, this should happen at 6.48 a.m. Take the shot. Easy, right? More photographers keep arriving. Closer to showtime, the street's looking like a stadium. Here we go. This is it. It's time. I knew I'd be busy shooting this story with my iPhone, so I didn't bring any sort of gear capable of getting that iconic hinge shot. But a peek at social media will show you what some of these artists captured. I did come back a year later with my only DSLR, and this was the best I could do. You'd think everyone would end up with the same picture. I think I got a pretty good shot. I'm sure there were some people who didn't clean their lenses and the glare is just insane. <laughs> because uh, the sun wasn't like all the way center. But these photographers are magicians, somehow maintaining detail in the shadows while letting the star of the show shine bright. <laughs>